This could be our last goodbye, our last goodbye, she never told me why. This could be our last goodbye, oh I won't meet again. We watched her breathing through the night, through the night with a candle burning bright. She couldn't get to sleep that night, she won't have that problem anymore. My bathroom looks like a crime scene now, blood on the floor and the walls in the loo. Let's hope they never find her body or I'll be a dead woman too. Oops, I kinda stole Meta for all of lunch. Well, I bought him some snacks for the rest of the week, too. Knowing him, they won't last past tomorrow. For a second, I thought you meant that you ate Meta for lunch, and nothing else. I mean, sometimes. They won't. <coughs> what? I just think it's cute that boys eat so much, that's all. I do too, in my own way, but he finishes off what I consider a week's worth of groceries in two days. Adorable, but also makes me happy we shop at bargain stores! What's wrong with it being used? Nothing! Much like whenever Segan talks ever, I can't tell if Sergey is talking about actual food or dick! Nothing at all. Good food should be eaten, and at bargain market prices, it isn't a problem to buy food every few days. Yeah. My uncle and I buy food every two to four weeks, though, so it's a bit of an adjustment for me. Uh. Yeah, I have no problem feeding Meta, and if you happen to be there, you. Even if my uncle says we can't afford to feed all my friends. If I buy the flour, it shouldn't be a problem to bake a cake or pizza for us all. It's nice to know that I'm thought of also sometime. Dear God, at least when Waylon says it, it's endearing. Who's Waylon? Arthur Corey's brother? He's not glamorous enough to be Corey sued, I guess. I don't make it a habit to cook for other men, but I used to bring a banquet to high school every day to feed my group. For some reason, the women at my school rarely brought or bought their own food in it. Put the uh, men in our group out paying for all of us, so I started bringing or buying enough to share. Since I no longer have a high school lunch group, it isn't a problem for me to expend the same volume of food on you and Meta. By the way, Sergey, do you eat meat? Or rather, is there anything you don't like to or can't eat? Mangoes and shrimp. Two of Matt's favorite foods. Awesome! Good, those things are expensive. So you like steak, chicken, burgers? Hey, I could go for a steak, chicken, burger. Why don't you offer it to me? Anything, as long as it's not mangoes or shrimp. Good, I only get mangoes for Meta, and I like shrimp myself, but I don't know how to cook it. Are you serious? You just put it in boiling water to defrost and then saute it with lemon and garlic. I miss cooking meat, like actual meat. Dirty mind. Sorry. Never ever cook that. Well. It's not like Tokiomi would let her. You know what? Never mind. I shouldn't encourage Sergei's inappropriate conversings. Oh, but I have a certain way of cooking chicken that I think turns out really well. I have a habit of cooking steak very rare, though, since my uncle thinks not pink means burned when it comes to steak. But I'll probably cook it medium or medium well if I make it for someone else. Our meat is high quality, so you wouldn't have to worry about getting sick from our steak, but as a courtesy, you know. Yay, rare it is then. What? I'm sure Tokiomi will be pleased that I'm actually taking meat for lunch now. I stop for a while. See, I tell him the food is for me to avoid hearing about how I shouldn't be feeding everyone. But I've always been a big meat eater, and I think he was getting suspicious that I stopped cooking steak and chicken for myself. Can you not hear the enthusiasm in my voice? Can you not tell how many fucks I believe should be raining down upon you? When I miss cooking the things I'm used to cooking, 
I'll make or get meta anything he likes, but as I said, I believe good food should be eaten and we rarely have a shortage of meat in the house. Also, meat's one of those things that does taste good after it's cooled down. So it's easier to make with tomorrow's lunch in mind, you know? Yummy! <laughs> so it's settled. I will occasionally make you lunch as well. I'm sure it'll be okay if I cook for you and then bake for Meta. Sounds fair sometimes. Well, I do my best cooking with meat, and baking is like a fallback of sorts, you know? If I make cookies or cake, I'm making enough to share, but when it comes to Meta, there's very little I know how to cook for him. Well, I hope you guys enjoy whatever I come up with. I'm going to get back to watching TV and knitting, and then I need to do some house cleaning. I need to get back to TCU. Have, um, fun? No. Or be bored, whichever. Bored is more like it. Stage quit. Well, I'm bored. Not to worry! Just out of curiosity, do you actually like Jay in a romantic way? Isn't that kinda personal? Why would it be personal? Sorry, I was just curious because I like him. Oh my god, your taste in men is worse than mine and that's really fucking saying something. Anita, why don't you just tell her directly that you'd asked Jay out months ago and you noticed her flirting with him? He shouldn't be entertaining another woman's feelings anyway while you're waiting for an answer, but if Ty knew, maybe she would back off him. Tara, I want to be with Jay. We had talked about dating when he got settled in California. I like Jay a lot. I think I might even love him, and I'm willing to throw a crush into the wind and start my relationship now and try to make that work. I've known him for years, and he's always stood by me, no matter what. If you harbor any romantic feelings for him, I understand. But I won't back down if you want to pursue him too. Okay, whoa, I was with you right up until that point. The entire point of asking a friend if they're interested in someone that you're interested in is to back off in case they are. Tactical scheming is redundant, but yes, it's definitely not just curiosity. I won't give up the fight until one of us wins his heart. Might I suggest a variation on the Thunderdome? Uh, you mean the Blood Dome? Then you For those of us what don't speak Japanese, you are already, already dead. And this chick is Scottish, but trying to be Japanese. It's sad. How? Has he agreed to go out with you? Oh, please, if that's all a relationship took, I'd be in a relationship with every cat that crossed my path. Kinky. Onion? No. Onion, yes. Wait, it's Orion. That doesn't make you the winner. I don't want my personal stuff known. Like that you're a weeboo? Sucks for you. His hat isn't yet yet. Kingdom Hearts! Fap, 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 fap. He cares for you, but his kokoro is mine! Aruba, Jamaica, ooh, I wanna take a Bermuda, Bahama, come on, pretty mama! Ah, I said kokoro, not coconuts! Well, excuse me, Hime chan. It doesn't work that way, you little shit. Fuck you, Evren. I am doing.
doing the best I can, but this script is not making it easier on any of us. Does Jay get any say in who gets his, uh, Kokoro? White whales. Stay white. <laughs> Look, I've been trying to learn how to say it, okay? I'm just- Kokoro! Uh, Look, I'm, I'm- You said I could mock you for this. I know, I kind of regret saying that, but, like, I've- I've been, like, reading on, like, how I'm supposed to- It's- it's- it's very- I'm- I'm not very well coordinated. I'm not a well coordinated person. Um- Kevin. <laughs> I I am not always very good at controlling what sorts of mouth noises happen. Sometimes they're not the mouth noises I want to have happen. I'm just bad at talking sometimes. That's okay. So as I, I really, really, really hate recording certain characters' lines. I'm not going to say whose, but... Take my word for it, some of them are not easy, and I have to do like five takes. So, you know, I'm taking the mickey out of you in a fun way. Okay. <laughs> I'm not actually judging you All for right. not being able to pronounce Kokoro. Okay, thank you. <laughs> Kinky. Onion, no. Kokoro means heart. And Kokomo is a fantastic holiday destination. Personally, I don't understand why either of those girls want Jay's heart. Hearts taste weird. No, they don't. What are you talking about? Maybe it's a texture thing? I don't know. I just never really liked them. Aruba, Jamaica, ooh, I wanna take it. Bermuda, Bahama, come on, pretty mama. Key Largo, Montego, baby, why do we go? Jamaica off the Florida Keys. There's a place called Kokomo That's where you wanna go To get away from it all Bodies in the sand Tropical drink melting in your hand We'll be falling in love To the rhythm of a steel drum band Aruba, Jamaica, ooh, I wanna take you to Bermuda, Mama, come on, pretty mama, Key Largo, Montego, baby, what a 